Our oil change programme, our Metro Reinvigoration, is a central government funded scheme to future proof the Metro, in other words for the next generation of citizens in Tyne and Weir. It's a scheme that involves about 100 projects per year over 11 years uh, and it deals with everything from the tracks to the stations to communication systems to ticket and vending machines. The metro system is 34 years old. We carry about 37 million passengers each year and the reinvigoration scheme is to allow the next generation of citizens to yield benefits from what's been invested. The current system that we have is old, obsolete, unreliable in modern day terms and that's why we went out to the market to procure a new system. When we were starting to consider what new communication system we select, it was really important that it was the most up to date, it was reliable and it was secure and these were the real critical parts that we went out to the market on in what was an international procurement um, uh, programme. We are currently in our fifth year of Metro reinvigoration and at the most critical point in terms of selecting key systems that will last for generations to come. One of those is our radio system that communicates between the driver and the control room and vice versa. And that's the reason why we've taken so long to get the specification right when we've gone out to the market. Our 11 year programme will see us spend 389 million. Of that, our radio communication system is costing just short of £8 million. The new system is critical to Nexus. We need quick, reliable and efficient communications between the drivers and the control room. After going out to an international procurement programme, we've now selected a £7.7 .7 million contract. And I'm pleased to say that our contractor is Caps Carriercom from Austria. Whilst this may be a less glamorous and public facing part of our reinvigoration programme, its criticality is at the heart of what we're doing. In order to have a reliable system, a modern system and importantly a secure system that allows the drivers to communicate with the control room, we have specified a Tetra radio system and CAPS Carriercom have managed to provide assurances to us that they have the product that we need here in Newcastle. We have a sophisticated and robust procurement process here in the Tiny Weir Metro. Uh, in the case of a radio communication system, we embarked upon a European-wide procurement process and CAPS Carriercom came back with the product that we wanted. Um, they demonstrated to us during the procurement process their expertise, the quality of the product, the reliability of the product and many other features that we were very enthused about. CAPS managed to capture our imagination when it came to what they had to offer. Two things spring to mind in that regard. One is the resilience they're designing into the system and that will make it far more reliable for the users of the Tiny Weir Metro. And the other thing is at the point of migration from the old system to the new system, that will be done in a seamless fashion, making it easier for our operators and control room staff. CAPS will be delivering modern technology into a 34-year-old rolling stock and it's a bespoke project in that context and one of the attractions is the way in which CAPS will approach that will mean it's a much easier fitment programme and much easier to train the drivers who operate this system. CAPS will deliver a solution that brings us from analogue to digital and doing so will vastly improve the reliability with the most modern technology available. The new Tetra radio system will improve vastly quality and reliability. It brings a new level of security and resilience to our network and that will benefit our customers and our staff. Tetra signals are harder to intercept, meaning it's more secure and less susceptible to interference from mobile networks. The new system will see better sound quality, enabling us to use it in a noisy environment and importantly it has a self-monitoring capability allowing us to diagnose and rectify faults and failures should they arise. This is one of the most important projects in our All Change programme and Nexus is very pleased to be working with CAPS who have an excellent global track record.